Uh, hey everybody, uh, Mr. Nationwide here. Uh, we're just doing a late night vlog. Yeah, I was just coming from the gas station just to get a little snack. I just got off work. It's almost 11.30. And uh, we got road construction here on US 70 at the interchange, which uh, will connect to the left turn lanes of uh, White Oak Road. Yeah, so we're just putting another batch of the uh, asphalt on one lane and you know they're still building uh, Cabells yeah, so it's gonna take a little while though but I mean, at least they're doing this at night time instead of daytime besides there's not that much traffic yeah I had I had to take over a shift it was a second shift from uh, 2 30 to 11 just got up 11 got everything done on time and then uh, let be on the way over to Lock Lowe's, see who's there, you know, just have, have, relax and have a drink. You know, I'm off tomorrow, so it's a big deal with me. Oh, shoot, looks like somebody got pulled over by the Popo, the Fuzz, the Bylaw Dicks. Oh, shit. <laughs> I try to push the set button on the cruise control and just keep it set at 40 through the zone just to avoid a cop that pulled me over. Yeah, chances are in this time of night, you know, cops will pull you over for any reason. Yeah. So, you know, avoid that problem. Like, uh, you know, you go in the 45 mile an hour zone, you just do about uh, 40, well, I mean, have your cruise control set at 45. So it doesn't look like you're going, you know, too, too fast or too slow over the speed limit. Sometimes I do like 5 over the limit, you know, they, they say it's fine by them, you know, as long as it's not 10 over or more. So, anyway, for uh, you know, tonight just checking out what's going on. Walk loot. I think they have a drink special tonight, like uh, any uh, they'll make some beer for a dollar, so uh, it's pretty awesome. There, I'm just gonna have one anyway, probably an hour and a half, and you know, socialize, and then probably go home. It'll be probably by 11 30 or 1 o'clock. I'll be at home, yeah. So, anyway, uh Today with the truck, you know, I was checking out, you know, why, uh, you know, the alignment is not, uh, you know, where, right where it should be. So it turns out the the driver's side front sway bar link was a little off and it was loose, and it feels like, you know, it's doing some kind of weird shaking when I'm turning the wheels when you know the truck is still. So that has to be replaced. So it's about maybe ten dollars each or ten dollars for two of them so you know you might as well do the passenger side too as well and it looks like the one on the passenger side is you know on tight real good and uh, actually the walk loaded to the left so I'm just going to be in the left lane to be prepared anyways uh, uh, I then bump into uh, the manager over at Best Towers of Raleigh when I was over in Party City you know he was off you know the shop was closed I was picking up a costume and he was picking up in costume too and, uh, you know, I told him about it, and I said, uh, you know, I seen a misplaced the receipt. And I said, well, well, it's not a problem. You can just go over there Wednesday morning, you know, and see what they correct and uh, fix for whatever. And, uh, you know, it would be no extra charge as long as you're still in the warranty. So, uh, so, anyway, I was still in the warranty. It's probably been, uh, three weeks ago. So, that, that shouldn't be too bad. Yeah. So, anyway, I have the music off. Anyways, got an auxiliary. Am I uh, moving neon light? Oh yeah, the truck downshifted a little bit, you know, because there's a little hill. So you know, there's not that much traffic here on US 70 in Garner. Just past my exit, which is Andover Springs Road on this overpass. Uh, you guys probably can't see it. And there's a relay up ahead over. No, actually, it just turned green over New Rand Road. So it's just next red light. Oh shoot, I think I see a cop. Oh no, no, it's just a Nissan Ultima. It seems like it's broke down or something. It's like to the side of the road. I understand how. I mean, that, that, I mean, that car is newer than this truck. I mean, no sense. Yeah, and that's another thing. I mean, I got, I got towing included with my insurance. It's like a dollar more, but just in case the truck breaks down, which is, you know, virtually impossible, that, uh, you know, in case something happened, I get towed away at least. 
instead of just leaving it out somewhere on the side of the road or somewhere out overnight, we're just going to, you know, get stolen or vandalized or somebody siphoning gas or the license plate being stolen. Shit like that happens. Okay, there's lock and loaded. There's not that many cars out, but eh. There's not that many bikers in tonight. Yeah, so probably probably in the next few weeks, uh, you know, it's come month of November, uh, there'll be, you know, a video of the first anniversary of the Shugham Shack Moisture Bar Sucks Part 1 and Part 2 videos that I filmed on site. Yeah, and I'll show you, I'll show you how empty that place looked after, after it's been shut down and go a little bit more in detail. Yeah, because the, the other day I bumped into an Englishman that I met well, over a year ago in that same place. And uh, it was at Wednesday night at another bar, of course, at Air Sports Sports Bar, a karaoke night. And he was just telling me about some stuff about, you know, what the kids of the owners were doing, you know, breaking around this and that. Yeah, so, you know, just cocking over the program and shit. Yeah, so, you know, it's just some crazy stuff going on in that. Huh, looks like my... Looks like I have two friends over there. Yeah. Because I, I see them almost every time I go over to Lock and Load in Aiersboro, but, you know, it's, it's, there's some people I talk to and stuff. I'm also parking it. I'm also parked further than enough because I can't see where the white line is at in the dark. Should be good enough. Uh, let's see. Anyway, folks, I'm uh, just about to go inside and you know enjoy you know a cold one after a long day of work. You know, chit chat with some friends and stuff like that. So uh, um, I'll see. Tune you in later, and good night. <laughs>